Hi, in this video we will see how to do a pie chart animation. In, pre in previous video we have seen how to do a bar chart animation and then line chart animation and fade in animation and how to implement SVG in HTML. So I am going to open the illustrator file. I am going to create one pie chart. So I am going to give value three, two, five, six. Mm, apply. Close this. I am going to take select two. I am going to change the color. Sky. So I'm going to select this whole pie chart in object artboard fit to artwork bounds or fit to selected art both will work so now i'm going to save this as an svg file file save as svg i'm going to give name as pie chart so here I am not giving the preserve illustrator editing capabilities I am not going to edit uh, in further the animations so I am just uncheck this you will see everything is image location embedded SVG 1.1 then press ok so I will check my local folder so here the SVG file is coming fine now I am going to open this SVG file in text editor so as you can see this is a pie chart file Uh, in bar chart have the layer id layer on same so i'm just going to change this as like layer 5 and i'm also going to change this class parent so i'm just find and replace Selected test dot test and just put layer five dot test. So we just to make sure that it doesn't conflict with other SVG files. So now save this. I'm just I'm going to implement this pie chart SVG in HTML. So in source code, I already created uh, one div called pie chart animation. And here I have called the jQuery library. After calling this, I have called the pie chart animation and I have called the pie chart svg file here so here this is a pie chart animation class inside that I am loading pie chart svg file so I am just going to save this 
I'm just going to check whether it is coming or not. Yes. It is coming. But the color is uh, no, not appearing properly. So just going to check whether it is coming fine from here. Right, so. Okay, this color is. Uh, gone so i'm just undo what i did the changes here now it is coming fine so i'll keep that as it is uh, if i want to do the changes while saving the illustrator file i'm just going to save as svg yes Preserve the illustrator capabilities, then press OK. Now, if you see, yes, now we are getting the code like this. I'm just going to give one comment here so this code won't reflect in browser, otherwise, it will come like this in browser. Example. is coming fine but here i am getting this code i want to remove this code so i am going to comment it save then reload now it is gone so i will reduce the file this animation is um, cg file so for the Pie chart animation main.css here. I'm going to give the width like 400 pixel. I'm going to give margin, margin left 20 pixel, sorry, top bottom 20 pixel, and left right. Like 40 pixel. So okay, it's coming fine. So in SVG file, I'm going to give one uh, code like a circle uh, element. So I already returned this default element. For example, this is a circle. So make sure to put this before sorry uh, SVG close tag. Paste it here and I have called the ID circle animation. I'm just going to copy this and make sure to CX CY is 50% and R equal to it is a radius 50% so save this and in CSS file I'm just going to call this circle ID and I will just mention fill like black color Okay, that is coming fine so if I just hover it this is the circle and this is the fill so if I make fill so now I will just add the animations so 
Let me just copy the whole part. And I'll paste it here. I'm going to remove the fill. We don't need this now. So and we are calling the circle animation tag. So I'm going to call this circle animation using keyframes. Keyframe circle here to stroke dash array offset 350. So let's check whether how it will works. Okay, animation is working fine. So the reason why I have given the black color is to know whether the animation is working properly or not. So here, uh, if I don't give the fill opacity, then you won't see the animation effects. See the full black color you will see. So that is the reason why I am giving the fill opacity. So this is the stroke color. If I remove this animation, this is the stroke color. It is just giving the border to this circle, but that is not visible. So that's why we are giving the border to the circle and we are giving that border uh, black color. If I give white color here, example here. If I do the animation, so from out of nowhere, this animation is happening. The effects will look like that the circle is coming out of nowhere. So make sure uh, for this pie chart, the background should be in a plain color to do the changes. That the changes needs to be done in stroke here. White, if I give. any color so animation will happen so make sure to keep this stroke dash array 315% and stroke dash offset to 0% transform merging to center center and transform make sure this to rotate z 90 degree and rotate y to minus 180 degree and the animation uh, like uh, the stroke offset needs to be 315% for this animation from 2 to the animation here as I given keyframe stroke offset so here what we are doing is from 0 to 315 offset we are doing the animation and nothing else so uh, I have given the more details of no, stroke offset in line animation we can refer that video so this is the clockwise svg pie chart animation you can do even anti-clockwise for example i will give um, okay here rotate z minus 90 degree and rotate y in transform and make it as zero this this is the anti-clockwise animation so that's it thank you